Vita, the vlog every day in April challenge. Nick began his journey in the beginning of April, determined that he would succeed in this mission, but on the sixth day he realized there was much more to Vita than what he had been willing to bet. He then experienced the consequences of missing a day and went through many challenges. Although a long and troubling journey, he has made it almost all the way through, and him and his companion Vic have decided, after much deliberation, that it is time that they let their third companion, Slick, the newcomer, the new arrival, that it is his turn to do a vlog himself. Again, I did say, after much, much deliberation, it was decided. I'm <laughs> Are you kidding me? You call that vlogging? Well, congratulations! You've proven that you're just as terrible at vlogging as your brother Vic! Sorry, stepbrother. I told us all this! No one can understand you! You told me that you were taking voice lessons! Get the lessons! I'm sorry, but that's not my problem. But what is my problem is that I have an entire audience who spent the last two minutes of their life wasting it listening to you mumble! <laughs> No, what's ridiculous is the fact that we're still having this conversation. <laughs> you, know, you know what? It's over. This is the end of our conversation, okay? It's over. Done. <sighs> I'm really sorry about that. You know, I, I really, really have to Stop letting other people vlog for me. This is something that I decided I would do, and I should just go ahead and do it myself. So again, I, I do apologize. Hey guys, I hope that you enjoyed today's video. I actually do have a bit of a surprise for you. Uh, down in the little doobly-doo, you'll find a link to, to an MP4 file of Vic's original story. And so if you'd like to take part in some of the fun of Vita yourself and engage yourself with my channel, here's what you can do. Follow that link, which will take you to a page where you can actually download the MP4 file of Slick's original story. From there, you can take that file and import it to whatever sort of editing software that you have at home. And I want you to edit in your own story. Give the video your own subtitles to explain what it was that Slick actually said. 
After you do this, I want you to give it its own title, whatever you seem fit. I want you to share it in the, in the comments below, a link to the video. Also, if you want to share it on Twitter, use the hashtag what Slick really said. I'm excited to see what stories you might be able to come with and what sort of background you can give Slick. The only thing I ask, of course, though, is that you do keep it at least relatively clean, and also that you would leave a link in your video to this video here so people can at least get some sort of context to why you made the video that you did. And if you make some that I really, really like, I'll share them on my Twitter. Um, so again, that video will be down in the uh, little box below. You can download the MP4 file. As long as no one abuses uses this, I will leave that up, but again, I do ask, keep it clean. Thanks. See you guys later. No, but what is ridiculous is the fact that we're still having this conversation. You know what, in fact, it's over. This here, this conversation is done. Period. End of the book, okay?